second and ten. Rock going deep for Keith Baker, and it was just knocked away at the final moment by Marcellus Green. Baker, for sure, thought that he had six. Well, Dieter Brock not worrying about the wind as he throws deep into it, and he takes a pretty good shot releasing that football, but Keith Baker in behind Marcellus Green, but at the last second, Green able to tip that ball away. On the left is a very confident Bob Obilovich. Al Bruno was very uptight the last couple of days, and yet his club has come out here, and they look fairly loose. I was talking to the players a couple of days ago at practice. They said he was really quite tight during the week, and the players felt it was up to them to try and relax themselves. And appears that you're right, Patrick. <laughs> Good job. First down, Toronto at their 40-yard line. Holloway slips. And then goes down at about the 43-yard line. John Priester was able to get over and get him. blocking strategy by Bob Palsik, the offensive line coach of the Argonauts. They're going over a few things, trying to figure out what the Hamilton front four is doing to that offensive line. Seven minutes, ten seconds left in the opening quarter. Hamilton seven, Toronto one. Second and eight, tie catch. Brock going deep again for Baker. He's there, and he's into the Toronto 50-yard line. Two yards the gain on the pass from Brock to Keith Baker. One of the advantages, Leaf, of course, is the fact that the Cats with Dieter Brock at one of the few quarterbacks can, as they say, throw holes in the wind. So this strong wind doesn't seem to be bothering him. Evidently not, Bill. And, you know, Dieter's such a veteran, he read the blitz coming there. Rocky DiPietro couldn't hang on to the football. But an indication maybe of the theory of the Argonaut defense, anytime they get them in second and long, they're going to come after him. Ruoff booted at 41 yards his previous punt. He puts this one high, another good boot. Mitter will allow it to go into the end zone, and he'll give up the single point. So the Ticats take an 8-1 to one lead with 5 minutes and 34 seconds left to play in this opening quarter. Stacey, Ken McEachern, tell me, what are the defensive strategies of the club? Well, we're trying to mix things up. We're playing a little bit of a 4-3 front, and we're mixing it up. And we're trying to change looks on them. Basically, what we're doing is we haven't gotten to them yet, and they're zoning off some of our blitzes, so we'll make some adjustments come after them harder. In other words, you're trying to get to Brock. Oh, yeah, well, that's the name of the game, get to the quarterback. Especially when he's being hurt. Well, it doesn't matter. He looks healthy to me, so we just have to go get him. Thanks, Ken. First down, Toronto from their 35. Holloway puts it up looking for Greer. And he is not able to make the catch. Neatly broken up by Mike McIntyre and Mark Young. Holding, Toronto number 69, decline, third down. That's the left guard, Dan Ferroni, number 69, but the Ticats wave off the penalty and force Toronto into a punting situation. Well, this is a day of the kickers, I think, with the wind boy. Here's Bernie Ruoff. Bernie, you're doing a good job into that way. You're keeping it low. I have to. You know, everybody forgets I played in Winnipeg for five years. In Winnipeg, you don't go and play without a win. I've been lucky both times now. The wind's died down a little bit just before I kicked it. And hopefully, maybe it's our turn today. There's some pockets in there that aren't as windy, isn't it? No, no, midfield 30. The far end zone is really tough. If you get down to this end, it's a little bit easier. Bernie, you guys are really fired up. We gotta be. This is, this is our shot. Respectability. This is our shot. Good luck. What a psychological lift for the Ticats going against this wind to be able to control the football the way they are. We're down to 247 left to play in the opening quarter. It is a Hamilton first down. The ball is spotted just inside the Toronto 49-yard line. A little welcome to the ball game for Dieter Brock by James Curry, but good second effort by Mark Braganola. The pass from center was bobbled, and then Brock, fortunate to get the ball back, is sacked by Earl Wilson. I'll, I'll tell you what, I thought James Curry was trying to remove Dieter's 
helmet on that play, and he sure did. There's no question the Argonaut front four, they know what they have to do to be successful in the ball game. They have to get to that fellow right there. Loss was a couple of yards. It's back now to about the 50 and a half yard line. Underneath two minutes left to play in this opening quarter. Hamilton eight, Toronto one. Looking for Ron Johnson, who's wide open and has it. At the 27 yard line, Leroy Paul finally brings him down, but Johnson was wide open. 